A post-pandemic travel boom is hitting Utah as people rush to book trips and tours in the Beehive State. As Fox 13's Lauren Steinbrecher reports, local businesses say there is a reason people are flooding to Utah. The airport tells me they're ready for a busy summer season. And as people fly here into Salt Lake City, that means our national parks are going to be busy. Places to stay are going to be full and tour companies completely booked out. It's almost summer vacation time, and with COVID restrictions lifting, plus vaccination numbers rising, travelers are saying it's time to venture out. I thought last year was busy. This year, it's just exploded, and it's even, it's, the numbers are climbing even higher. International travel is still iffy, so the next best thing, the great outdoors of Southern Utah. All of those travelers who are very well-traveled individuals can't do their normal trips. They're looking to the local destinations that have been on their list of places to go see and visit. A post-pandemic travel boom, keeping Beehive State companies busier than ever. It's, you know, COVID revenge, so to speak, on the travel industry. Jason Murray Killed with Southwest year, Adventure Tours you know. says his multi-day tours in Southern Utah are filling up through fall, with many dates completely sold out. His day tours are busy through September. So even those things are getting sold out um, in advance then and that's not normal so it's like people are planning more ahead it's definitely busier than it has been in the past this time of year matthew tesdall owns like family time vacation summer. rentals he says they're seeing more people opt to rent homes and visit rural areas their cabins and homes are booking up faster, he says, with customers driving in from northern Utah and surrounding states to unplug. And these guys can get together and have have family or friend time, which we, you know, which a lot of these states that we're offering to, they can't do that this last year. So it's it's uh, it's been great for them. They've they've loved it. Family Time Vacation Rentals still has plenty of open spots, however, but Southwest Adventure Tours a little less so. So if you want to book that ticket or tour, according to them, now is the time. Murray had a little tip for locals. Try to find some off the beaten path places to explore in Utah this year. Now his next tour group is going to be flying in here tomorrow for a week long trip down in southern Utah. At Salt Lake International Airport, Lauren Steinbrecher, Fox 13 News, Utah.